Man, guys, when I tell you a lot of stuff has changed, a lot of stuff has changed the last few months, like our new 3,000 square foot facility. We got this new Ford Transit van, which conveniently is for the Holiday Light Company, but also for Fusion, and we got it wrapped in this nice stealth matte black, and then we got the glossy finish on the things. Greensboro Holiday Light's powered by Fusion Sound and Lighting. Got all the logos on the back, all the different companies, GHL, GHS, all good to go. And my garage is finally empty. All that's left is my personal stuff. Little to say it's been a crazy last three months or just in general this last year has been insane. Our company has grown 280% over the last year. It's been insane. Thank you guys for following and being part of the journey. I can't do this alone. Like you guys have been there from the beginning. If you guys weren't there at the beginning, just know Go look back at some of the older videos. You'll see me filming in my parents' basement when I first started out as a DJ. Where I've taken my career, I've gone from being a high schooler, being in college, to getting a job outside of college in engineering, to quitting my engineering job, pursuing this full-time, to now running an extremely successful company with three additional full-time employees and multiple other part-time employees all of which now have access to health insurance. We were in this garage just last year, actually this year, trying to make the DJ company and every company that we run, DJing, both lighting and our holiday lighting all ran out of this garage. And now all that's literally left is just home stuff. Like that's stuff for my lawn, drywall, parts and things, because I like the DIY, I'm an engineer, I'm working on our countertops right here. It's crazy. This is all my tools, like these are my tools. This is all the stuff for my upcoming wedding. Me and Christine are engaged. Uh, we we're gonna be getting married in February. I'll drop a link to our registry down below if any of you guys are interested in, I don't know, getting us a gift or something? I don't know. Christine said to drop the registry list on my YouTube channel and see if you guys wanted to you know, participate. But anyways, life updates. This stuff's crazy. I still have my home office. The office is still here. The studio upstairs for the podcast is still here. This is where I still do all of my work. The new warehouse is purely for the team. So with that said, let's go ahead and go on a little tour. Well, first off, we gotta start with the location. We got a pretty ideal location. Literally, this is a main, almost like state route, dual highway going down through here. Great billboard location. We got the signs up there, looks good. Let's go inside. Oh, and excuse the mess because we just moved in like a week and a half ago. So we're still organizing and we're still working. What are you doing on New Year's Eve? You're tuning into our awesome live stream because the mainstream media, like New Year's Eve coverage, sucks let's be honest so we're gonna change that tune into my channel my youtube channel dj rick webb on new year's eve you guys can set your reminders and everything from 9 p.m eastern standard time until 1 a.m we're gonna be doing a giant dj set to make new year's eve amazing you got myself performing we got dj marcellus dj show out the whole fusion sound and lighting team we're gonna be doing live performances in a boiler room setup at my house with all kinds of people involved crazy lighting we'll be doing giveaways you guys can register for the giveaways right now we'll be giving away both lighting tubes we're gonna be giving away uh both lighting mini movers and we're gonna be doing a live stream giveaway through donations you guys can donate on the stream for interactive things you guys can request songs you can do shout outs you can even buy me a shot on the stream it's going to be insane and if we hit our donation cap of i think it's 250 bucks check the details down below but 250 bucks we're going to be giving away four unit bags of ir4s to the people on the stream live this is going to be insane you guys got to join 9 p.m eastern standard time new year's eve massive blowout live stream it's gonna be amazing and a little insider bonus right now there is going to be an extreme special discount at midnight on bothlightingusa.com along with a complete website redesign you guys are not going to want to miss out if you're in the midst of looking to buy some lighting right now if you're on eastern standard time midnight there might be a huge promotion doing for just one hour only from midnight to 1 a.m. So you guys are going to want to tune in. You got to be live to win any of the prizes. We'll be providing all the amazing tunes because mainstream media sucks. And just come enjoy it. Come have fun with us on New Year's live on my YouTube channel. I'll see you guys there. Let's go. So again, got the signs up front. Got the nice windows on the front of the building. I will say they're sort of tinted, but 
they definitely need a lot more tint to prevent the heat getting in here because right now the biggest problem is the front gets super hot and the back is cold so we got some stuff on order for ventilation to try and fix that but main entry lobby way like i said we still got a lot of clutter uh they had a receptionist area here that we plan to tear this wall down and this wall down to make this one big room maybe some tvs couches bars etc um we do have a little snack corner already developed up here the fridge all the drinks all ready to go microwave the team has all their snacks basically ready to go coming back we're gonna pop into hannah's office without her even knowing we've actually gone through and painted pretty much everybody's office we've painted all the ceilings black we've replaced all the lights anything to tell the people hannah Hannah runs Fusion Sound Lighting, if you guys didn't know. She's the CEO. You just need to assume she's right. It'll save us time. Oh, 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 oh. Just know it says CEO. Everybody's got sit-stand desk. Hannah wanted a treadmill, so she's got a treadmill so she can walk and work. And Everybody's office is a work in progress. This is what the ceilings used to look like throughout the whole entire place. And we painted them black and added new LEDs instead of the ugly fluorescence. Alyssa's not here, but Alyssa is who runs our Greensboro Holiday Lights division. She's got little fun blue and white theme. Again, black ceilings. We've got a little fridge, a little sit-stand desk set up. We've been working on unbulbing some Christmas light stuff in here, it looks like. She's gonna try and do the, um, the viral thing where you put the cotton with LED strips on the ceiling that looks like lightning and stuff. We'll update on that as we go. Back little lobby area right here. We still need to paint the walls, but we've done the ceilings already. Um, we have a couple bathrooms, nothing to really show for. This is our back kind of storage area slash IT closet. We have lots of work to do when it comes to Ethernet, security cameras, all that sort of stuff. The extra paints in here. We got a Dyson for the office, you know, keep it clean. Toilet paper, all the little necessities is back here in this area. Again, lobby area. And then we have the Both Lighting USA office, which their LED sign is off right now. Boom. Both Lighting USA. So this is the where the two guys, Jordan, DJ Show Out right here sits, and the man behind Both Lighting USA, CEO Marcella Stowe. What up, Doug? Again, everybody's got sit-stand desk in here. He's got a nice little setup, similar to Hannah's, same two monitors. Microphone setup so we can record videos and content. Everybody's got Sono speakers. Pretty dope. We got some workout stuff here, some weights and stuff. Again, working progress, working progress, but here is what you guys probably care about. This is our back warehouse area where we have all the stuff, all the stuff. So we've gone from basically where my garage was roughly 400 square feet to now we have about 1400 square feet of storage capacity. It's pretty crazy. Yeah, we're still working on lighting here. We need these bright ones to replace these ugly fluorescents, but it's a work in progress. Got some trash laying around. Still working on organizing, of course. Ladders, base plates laying around. This is kind of all of our DJ gear. We got our ceremony racks over here. The Mackie Fump goes, the Maui Fives. All of our DJ controllers are down here. The SZ, the 1000, the Rev7, Newmark controller. We got our LD Icoas over there. We got the LD Systems Maui 28G3s. New speakers there. The 44s are right there. Projectors, random totes of drapery and lights. Here's all of our road cases down through here with all of our up lights and movers and stuff like that. Hedge wall. Up here is where all the Christmas lights is gonna go. This is the Christmas light pile as we are in December. So currently, these are all the empty totes of Christmas lights that are out in the world. Craziness and some of our kind of miscellaneous stuffs over here. Timers, bulbs, and all sorts of goodies. New reefs, new reefs. It's kind of like like Christmas like corner over here. But in between it is our both lighting USA stuff. So here's kind of our uh, bags that we can ship the people, our soft bags. These are four unit bags of tubes ready to ship out whenever. These are IR4 cases ready to ship. That is from the first batch of lighting that we started to actually get shipped to us directly so that we can provide expedient shipping for guys. If you didn't know, the Both Lighting USA team, we've been working hard on the back end and we now have items available for expedient shipping so that you guys can get your lights in like two to three business days instead of waiting 10 to 14 business days for it to be sent directly from the factory and we have a huge shipment four times the last shipment that we just ordered it'll be here in february stay tuned for that but that way you guys can get your lighting a lot faster we're excited about that but we got literally about 12 pallets of lights coming here that's why we've done this so that we have the space for it. Continuing, this is the repair corner. Like I said, Both Lighting USA, we're expanding. So now we have our whole entire Both Lighting USA workshop over here with all the different parts. You need remotes, we got them. You need chargers, tube parts, tube parts, 
circuit boards. We have all the parts to be able to basically service and warranty all the lights that we have and that we sell. The spare tubes, etc. Anything you like to add? Excited. It's exciting. Yeah. Now let's get to the fun stuff. If you're watching the video at this point, we are selling some gear to make way for some new gear that we bought. So it's not that it's broken or we don't like it. It just, it's gear that doesn't fit the form and function of what we're trying to do moving forward. So we're switching to pretty much all column arrays with the 44s. That's why we bought some Maui G, uh, 28G3s. Jordan's actually gonna be using those. We also have some RCF NLX 24s on the way, but we're trying to get rid of some of these speakers that we don't necessarily use. And those are the JBLs. So we have two JBL SRX 815Ps for sale, $800 each or make me a deal. And these are JBL VRX 918 subs. Those are 950 each. That's a slam deal. These cost $2,000 new. These cost $2,000 plus new. Um, and we got the cases, bags, casters already done on all of them. We're also getting rid of the LD Systems ICOA 15s. These are pretty much brand new. So we're gonna let those go for 450 each. So for the most part, we're not shipping these items, but if you guys want to come basically purchase them, we're based in Greensboro, North Carolina. You can inquiry at info at flightingusa.com just put like use gear in the subject line that you're willing to buy it again srx 815s 800 each vrx 918s down there 950 each in the LD Systems ICOA 15s, getting rid of those for 450 each. Uh, again, no shipping, just come Greensboro, North Carolina, inquiry info at bowflightingusa.com. Oh, we also got some PARs for sale too. Okay, so if you guys are interested in some lighting, we got some uh, PARs as well for sale. We have 20 of these wired PARs. They're the ADJ Mega Hex PARs. They're wired, so no battery or anything like that. I've been trying to get rid of these for years now. I don't think I've used them in the last year, year and a half, two years maybe. So literally $100 per bag. We're, uh, we can ship these, but you have to pay for shipping, but basically $100 for four of them in a bag. I have five of them, so that's like 25 in total. Again, info at bowflightingusa.com, put subject line, use gear. We're trying to get rid of some stuff and clear out for buying more both lighting gear for the company to use and all that good stuff. Uh, we can go out back real quick, to finish kind of the tour. Again, look at how bright that light is. We need more of those. So this is our back area. We got plenty of room. Like my trailer sits over there with a nice hitch lock and everything on it so no one can take it. But uh, for events, guys can park. That's a huge parking lot right there. Our neighbors for the most part don't use it. We had a ramp built so that way we can get things rolled up and down. Little staircase here. We got our garbage which is overflowing because we just moved in. They're coming to take that soon. I gotta say guys, it has not hit me yet in terms of being surreal with having this space. Don't ask me why, but um, it's really, it's, it, it's it's crazy that we've expanded to this point. I think I said earlier in the video, the company has grown 270% across the board, all aspects of the company. Our DJ side is growing. Greensboro Holiday Lights is expanding like crazy. Both Lighting USA is growing so that we can provide better support for you guys. It's awesome to expand to have a facility. It hasn't hit me yet, it will eventually probably when I reflect on the year, because we've just been go, 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 go. I don't know what it's been, but it's literally since July. I went on vacation in July, and as soon as we got back, we went to Atlantic City. That was our August, September, got slammed with weddings, October slammed with weddings, November, Christmas lights went crazy, and it's just been a grind for the whole team, not even just me. The whole team is grinding right now, and uh, we're exciting, we're expanding. I'll also put this out there, we are hiring new DJs next year, so if you are in the North Carolina area and you're interested in working for the Fusion Sound Lighting team and myself, we are interested, so I'll leave a link down below. We have a hiring inquiry page where you can basically submit your application if you guys are interested. Uh, we will be doing interviews in here, we will be doing training in here. There's so many aspects to this facility that we're super excited about. Throwing events for vendors, it's crazy. I think that video can sum it up that this is crazy that we've expanded to this point. Um, and actually, I'm kind of shocked at how little DJ gear we got. Like, literally, this is all of our DJ gear right there. That's it. I, I guess minus the stuff we're selling over here in Burfa, but like, that's all of our DJ gear. And that could be a lot to some of you guys. That doesn't seem like much to me. It's probably because most of our DJs have their own gear. I guess we do have all the poles over there and everything. It's just like this facility makes us look small. And I'm super excited for us to be able to grow into this facility. Again, we have 3,000 square feet to work with in here and we're not even close to using all of it. And 
That's exciting. We're gonna be here for a minimum of three years. We are leasing. We did not purchase this facility for people that wanna know the more technical side of this. We are leasing it. It is, it is a lease facility. Cool part about at least business leases and this facility, we can do whatever we want within the confines of our walls. So like if we wanna tear down this wall here and get more storage, or if we wanna build an office this way, we can. If we wanna paint the walls, which we did. These walls were not black, by the way. We painted all those too. Everything was like a tan white when we first came in here. I hired some guys and they, came in here and basically knocked it out, got us all up and running. But we've been having a blast, having a blast. And it's super cool. When we first talked about getting the facility, when we like signed the paperwork, the team was talking about how they're gonna do like a flex schedule, you know, like, oh, I'll come to work on Tuesdays and Thursdays and I'll work from home on the other days because we've been working from home because we never had an office. And it's funny, but literally everyone like comes to work now for the most part, they don't stay at home. They literally come here to the office for the camaraderie, the teamwork. And I'm really excited with what we're building here. So more to come from the facility, we'll definitely do do a complete tour when we get the front room done, when we get all the gear back in here, when the Christmas lights is all back from January, it's all out there in the in the field right now. Once we get all that kind of situated and we got the van out back and all of our stuff is kind of together, like that whole workbench there, we have like tool walls and stuff to assemble and get everything actually like fine tuned in here. So when we get that all done, when we get outlets, that are gonna drop down from the ceiling and all that. We'll do a complete tour, but leave down in the comment section down below what you guys are most interested in knowing when it comes to one, the growth, two, the facility. Like what videos do you want me to film here? What videos do you want to learn more about in terms of business, growth, DJing, what gear you wanna see? We can do some speaker testing in here on the weekends because we did get a couple noise complaints already. It's all good, it's all good. Anyways, guys. Keep the record spinning and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.